Do you want to make your own Rocket League decal? Do you want to make your own Rocket League banner? Do you want to make your own Rocket League flag? Well, maybe not the flag part, but the decal and banner sounds cool. Well, welcome to this tutorial. I'll explain how you can do that, so let's get into it. First of all, we have to download and install Buckets Mod if you haven't already. You'll get this Buckets Mod zip folder, extract it, and install Buckets Mod. Step 2 is to go to the Buckets Mod plugin website instead and download Alpha Console for Buckets Mod. Once you have installed the Buckets Mod and the Alpha Console, you can go into Rocket League and we can see if it all works. Now to find out if Buckets Mod actually has been installed properly, you can press the F2 button to get this Buckets Mod display up. And if you can see this, of course Buckets Mod is installed. Press escape on the keyboard because that works. And now to see if the if the Alpha Console plugin works, you press F5 on your keyboard. And yeah, it comes up. You can also, when you press F2 to enter Buckets Mod, go to plugins and then Alpha Console toggle alpha consoles menu to get this same same way just a different if different route to get to it okay but now you want to get your own decal so how do you do that well first of all download the decal decal file i have in the description that way you'll get the files you need to make your own decal okay once you have installed the custom decal file you can extract it right click extract files boom You'll then be, be left with custom decal folder. Well, now comes the fun part, guys. Now, 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 now the part is here where you can actually make your own decal. So once you open the folder, you will have one Octane template and one Octane template for Photoshop. If you don't have Photoshop, you can open this with Paint or whatever and just do your, do your decal there. But if you have Photoshop, it's going to be a lot easier because then all these layers are divided up and... Uh, yeah, it's, it's basically a lot easier, but it works in, in whatever, whatever form of, of uh, editing you want, paint, Photoshop, etc. So I have Photoshop, so I'm going to open it here. So once inside Photoshop, we will see all these different folders, which basically contain all the different parts of the Octane. So let's see, here's the top. So if you want to wanna have, I don't know, a Pokemon car? You just search on Google for your favorite Pokemon. Okay, let's see. I like this Pikachu, so we're just gonna install that one. And when you've installed the favorite Pokemon, just drag and drop it into the Photoshop. Bang. And we're gonna resize this a bit. And make sure it's on the right layer. Right now it's under the top, it's underneath. We, we want it, we need it above the top, so I'm just gonna bring it into the top fo folder, put it there. It's gonna right here on the front very cute like who wouldn't want this honestly who wouldn't want this and you can you can do whatever you want to these sides you can uh, let's see we can write our name on the spoiler here here's the spoiler texture so if we go to the spoiler we see it we can just write gates rl real quick so once you got your name on the spoiler or whatever you want, like this is just a test little little test decal for you guys to see how you should do. And yeah, let's let's leave the decal here. You can do whatever you want with whatever part you want, but now let's actually get this to Rocket League. So you first of all you want to press save or file, then go to save as. And you're gonna to wanna to save it in, in your original folder with your custom decals, but not in a PSD. You want to have it in a PNG. And you want to name. The name is very important. It needs to be named oct underscore diffuse. Okay, once you have gotten your decal saved and in your in your special little custom decal folder, you now are gonna to want to take this into the actual alpha console so you can then get it in in game so to get this decal in game you need to just, just copy it and then go to your alpha console folder the the fastest way to go to to your to your alpha console folder is to press on the buckets mod go to file open buckets mod folder and press data or data whatever 
press press data, and then you want to go to AC plugin, Alpha Console plugin. You want to go to decal textures, and here it is. This is the place where what where you should drop it down. You can close this, close that, and now when you go into Rocket League, it's gonna be the final step. Then you're gonna have your awesome decal. Okay, we're in Rocket League again, and to get your decal. To get your custom decal to work, you need to have a octane with no decal. So, no decal is a stock octane, if you will. And then F5 once again to open the cosmetics here. You want to go to the decal texture mode and then find your decal. And here it says custom decal. You press it. You press it again for orange and blue team. And there we go. It's the it's the Pikachu car. Hey, let's get it. Let's get it. Okay, I misplaced the gates RL on the spoiler a bit, needed to be a bit higher up in the photoshop But then you just slide that bad boy up and you can go back and forth, do tweaks here and there But yeah, as you can see, this is now a, a decal that you made You can have whatever you want on your car So yeah, that's pretty cool And here's a decal I made for myself earlier so you can see how that looks I just wrote gates RL on the side of the car with my, basically my colors Pink in the back, blue in the front, kind of match the tiger. And oh wait, my my logo is on a banner. Hmm, can you do that as well? Interesting. Well, I guess I have to show you guys how you can get your your own custom banner now too. So to get your custom banner, you'll basically do the same thing as we did before. But instead of going to custom decals in the Bacchus mod folder, we go back, we go back to AC plugins, and then we will see. Ball textures, antenna textures, banner textures, hey, that's the one we want. So we enter the banner textures, and here we see the one I made before, and we will see some presets that are already here and available from Alpha Console. But let's say, hey, we got a nice little Pikachu car. We need a Pikachu banner now too, and I like that Nintendo one, so I'm just gonna open that with the Photoshop. Bang, here we go. And I'm gonna take the same Pikachu from our car, because... It was, it was too cute to not to take again. It's gonna resize a bit. Yeah, I'm going very very speedy this time too. Just just make it make it fast and so you guys get get how you do it. Place it place it there. See my name is gonna be like be like coming here. So I wanna have the Pikachu on the right side. And now we're gonna do the exactly same thing as we did with the decal, but we wanna save it in the banner folder in Bacchus mod. Save as PNG into this Bacchus mod folder, banner textures and Nintendo PNG that will, if I name the same as Nintendo PNG it will actually replace it straight away and that's fine by me but otherwise you can name it anything else save I'll replace in the Nintendo one because this is way cuter anyway when you have done completed your Nintendo PNG just go into this little texture pack which basically contains the code and let's see, I will not need the Xbox One so I'm gonna just rename this Xbox code to Nintendo and let's see, Nintendo PNG and let me just, for, for, for make it easier for myself, I'll just do Nintendo here too so this way when I go into, into Rocket League again I can choose a Nintendo banner as well as a custom banner so i can close this we go to rocket league okay once you have your pikachu decal in game and you have named your banner nintendo png and you have gotten all that to work you can now go to banner textures and you'll see a banner called nintendo you press it and bang there you go you got your pikachu banner your pikachu decal oi you're set mate you're set and you can also do the same thing with ball textures, you can do it with, you can do it with flags, but let's be real here guys, I can, I can show you guys how you can do a flag and a ball, but do you guys really need a tutorial for that? I've already covered how you do it, it's the same thing with ball and flag, you do exactly the same thing as I did with the, with the decal and the banner, so I think you guys know what to do now, and let's be real, will anyone actually make their own flag? That's debatable, but hey, I, I, I say successful Pikachu decal, successful Pikachu banner, you guys know what to do, so 
if you enjoyed this video or fo found it just a little bit helpful, please leave a like or maybe even consider subscribing. I'm trying to get to 1,000 subscribers, and once we get to 1,000, once we get to 1,000 subscribers, I'm doing a 1,000 Rocket League credit giveaway. I don't want to sell out too much, guys, but at 1K, guys, I have something special planned. You don't, you, you don't want to miss it. So thank you so much for watching this video. Hope you're having an amazing day. Stay positive, believe in yourself, and I'll see you guys soon. Later.